shown you many roof collapses over the past few days, but none more serious than this one. Overnight in Jenison, a mother and daughter trapped when the roof caved in around them. And 24 Hour News 8 Steve Kelso spoke with one of those women, thankful that she's still alive. Steve. And Brian, 81-year-old Margaret Scott and her daughter Carla had to be rescued this morning about 3.30 this morning. Take a closer look at this house. There is very likely nothing left. When I talked to Carla Scott this morning, she was just beginning to come to that realization herself. Because we don't have anything. All we had was our pajamas that we had on. That's all we have left. Carla Scott stands stunned, in shock, really, of how it all happened so fast. It was just a loud crack. And before I could get up to see what it was, it, the whole ceiling fell in on me. Rescuers removed her on a backboard. I was so scared for my mom. Her 81-year-old mother, Margaret, suffered only minor injuries. Carla says it's a miracle. If my mom would have been in her bedroom, she wouldn't be here right now. For some reason, Margaret Scott fell asleep in her favorite chair last night. Yeah, there's a lot of years in there. A lot of years. Now a family is forced to wonder what the future brings. The snow and the ice just destroyed it. It's gone. They can't get in to salvage anything. It's far too dangerous. 41 years. All my mother's uh, memories and family. We don't know if there's anything left. And anything that is left could end up getting trashed in the predicted rain. <sighs> but thankfully, and maybe miraculously, there is one thing left to hold. So I know the good Lord was with her, thank God. Because <laughs> I don't know what I would have done if I would lost my mom. <laughs> She's my best friend. <laughs> So obvious during that interview just how distraught she was about what had happened to her here. I asked her, why did you take the time to talk to somebody like me who came up and put a TV camera in your face? She said she wanted to get the message out. She'd actually raked this roof just a couple of days before. Well, that message is getting out. There's a steady stream of, look, of people coming by to check it out. And there are some of the cleanest roofs I've seen in a long time in this neighborhood in Jenison, where we're live tonight. Steve Kelso, 24-Hour News 8.